Detective Harry Sanders had seen his fair share of strange cases, but none quite like this one. When he received a call from the manager of the historic Grand Hotel, he knew it would be a doozy. It started with strange reports of guests hearing eerie voices and feeling cold spots throughout the hotel. The staff attributed it to the hotel's history of being a former asylum and its rumored connection to a cult. But when a wealthy businessman staying in the penthouse suite was found dead, everything changed. The cause of death was unclear, but there was one thing that was certain, the room had been cursed. It was said that anyone who stayed in the penthouse suite would be haunted by the ghosts of the asylum's former patients. Harry knew he had to solve this case before anyone else was hurt. As he delved deeper into the mystery, he uncovered a web of lies, deceit, and dark secrets. He discovered that the hotel manager had been involved in a money laundering scheme with the businessman, and had used the cursed room as a way to get rid of him. But the curse was more than just a legend. As Harry and his team conducted a paranormal investigation, they uncovered evidence of a malevolent entity that had been summoned by the cult. The entity had possessed the businessman and caused his death. With the help of a local psychic, Harry was able to perform an exorcism to banish the entity back to where it came from. The curse was lifted, and the hotel was able to return to its former glory. But Harry couldn't shake the feeling that there was more to this case than what met the eye. He had a suspicion that the cult was still active and that they were planning something much more sinister. And so, he kept his eyes and ears open, ready for the next case that would come his way.